Yep. Bed fishing wheeler. That's what Andy Buss is going to call me. <laughs> Jim, I think you should put one of them down and grab the smaller one. No, we're good. I should grab the small one. Yeah, too. Yeah, nice bag there. Start of the day. One big old foggy one. Fishing with Mr. Pinnell. Good morning. Hello. We gonna get it today. Jeremy, this one's going to be decent. Oh, shit. Didn't even know you had some stuff. So just in case if you missed it, there's number one. Ah, don't worry. Sure? Yep. God, he was running like he was. Jeremy went out and practiced and he caught a lot of fish flipping into pads, this and that. It's something I don't do a lot of. I was really excited to do it. I don't have a video on punching such this, that. It didn't work out. What happened was I let him do his thing. I worked the outside edge. Oh yeah, buddy. Good deal, brother. When you can go around a whole lake like that, Pipestone was not a big lake, and everybody was everywhere. I mean, like John Gibson said, 15 minutes in, the whole lake's been fished. He wasn't lying. It was that way. I targeted fish that were out away from the bank, off the spawn, resting. They wanted an easy bait. That's a big one. That in your eyeball, Andrew Bus. Oh yeah. Look what that hook was. Oh buddy. Look, hey. It's barely in. Look, the barber's not even in. <laughs> Give me another one. That that was a team effort right on that one, right? Can we get a yep. <laughs> oh Jim, we were catching them off the bed. They're in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good, that's four plus, right? <laughs> yeah, that's Call good it. fish. Same All right, thing. Mr. Bus, that one was for you. That fish we just seen on a bed. I don't bed fish. I did put my little worm over there though, and she said, <laughs> <laughs> Andy Buzz razzes me a lot because I never bed fish. I think I got him on this one. Hope so. Playing like he is. Definitely put a uh, measure. You know, I think it'd be all day. I definitely want to put a tag on. Yeah. You got a board. It's right Just, there under the. Oh yeah. yeah. I've never been in one of these boats. Before. Yeah, it's a nitro. It's a you know 2017 version. Yep. Jeremy Bennell and I are out on Pipestone. Never been here. We got a pretty good bag going right now. We got four in the box. Still got some time left. It's been a tough bite. A lot of guys are really struggling. Oh yeah. Better one, Jeremy? I feel like it's cheaper, but it's gonna be close. I don't think it's that good. I don't know. 
no line up for number five to me. He's fighting like he wants to be, but. Nope. Damn. Not quite, huh? Nope. I don't think so. Or for shits and giggles, yeah, sure. he might surprise you. You never know. All right, Jeremy, we just put our fifth one in the boat. Neither one of us thought that was going to happen. <laughs> it's noon and we fished till 1.30, so if that tells you what kind of day it's been. This kid, Jeremy Bennell, tries his heart out every time he's out. He makes a great partner, and partners are hard to come by. 24-7, it's like a marriage, to be honest with you. You can't get along, it ain't never going to work. It doesn't matter who catches them and who doesn't. It's a relationship. Period. Come on, come on. Come up there. That's a good one, dude. That's a big old fish. Oh, he's got me in the weeds. Come on, girl. Come on, girl. Come on, girl. Look at the toad. <laughs> Here, Mr. Bus. Why don't you take that one? So me fishing the outside edges, I was basically covering, I'm going to say 6 to 12 foot. It takes a while for that bait to get down. Jeremy was punching. We had the time to do that. It worked out. Wacky style baits, they just eat. They're lazy. They're resting from the spawn. Try them, guys. It doesn't hurt. It just takes some time. Small upgrade, Jeremy. Just Small. A, it's tiny. Here, let's show him the upgrade. <laughs> to be honest. I do have a uh, balance beam in there. I would probably balance gonna beam them on. Yeah, so Mr. Andy Buss and I we got a little relationship going. It's usually like a cat fight, but Mr. Andy Buzz caught one off a dock. And I got a gesture from him as he showed me the fish. I really didn't appreciate. So I reached in the box, grabbed our sixth fish, and I just threw it in the water. Not sure how he took it. I'm sure it wasn't good though. Good. Yeah. 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 Shit, I'd make a point both of them. If you're willing, we're good with it. So three nine nine. Did you even guys did you guys even catch it? Nope. I thought one told this to that was off. You even lift, bro? Yeah. Yeah, we were out here last year. Yeah, it was way better last year. <laughs> Oh no, got Fifteen seven. Nice. Come on. 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 Come Jeez. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Yeah. Fourth place, Mr. Boss. Not bad.
Hey Andy, that's a fourth place, bro. You can post it. Hey, if not, I will. <laughs> Spread them legs, Kenny. <laughs> Third place, Tommy and John Bryant. <laughs> carrots are healthy for you. Yeah, especially when they're coming out of your teeth. Keep eating some carrots. Jimmy might learn how to sight fish. 1432. Ken Holder, John Gibson. Atta boys. John Gibson. <laughs> Handled the net fine, First place is still on top. 15 7. Jeremy Burnell and Jim Wheeler. Good job, boys. Dilly dilly. I was like, shit, I'm sliding down, putting it in. That was a weekend for you. Yeah. In two nitros again. Two different ones. That don't, uh, that that neither nitro. one's mine. Big bass. Oh, okay. Did you? 4 15. Mm -hmm. David Horvath and Alexis. Yeah. Very nice. Nice job, guys. So I want to thank everybody for watching. Yeah. Almost at 500 subscribers. That's pretty big. It is for me. I mean, I'm a year and a half in or such, right around there. Uh, to me, that's a great accomplishment. I never thought I'd be there. I appreciate it, guys. Anything else I can do for you, put it in the comments. There's a lot of different types of fishing coming up. Punching, frogging, a lot of stuff. 